Hello and welcome to the Richie Rich Show. I'm Richard Walker and this is the show. Hey Rich. John, what part of band do you not understand? You owe all these good people an explanation as to why your show is so late. You might be right about that. But first... <laughs> Each Richie Rich show takes between 10 and 13 hours to edit. Not including the filming or the script writing, just the editing. Sometimes it's difficult for me to string together a few hours to make a show because I have to pay attention to my life. If I don't pay attention to my life, and for that matter if you don't pay attention to your life, our lives will become trash heaps. <coughs> Thank you for being patient. I'm constantly thinking of ways to bring you a better, regular Richie Rich show and I'm constantly paying attention to my life and affairs. For example, I have a nice, healthy bowl of juicy fruit waiting for me at the conclusion of this show. And because I'm paying attention to it, no one's gonna steal it. Right? Right? <laughs> Let's have some shout outs. First shout out goes to <laughs> Stephanie from London. <laughs> Stephanie, my dear, happy belated birthday. God bless you for your faithfulness and may he keep you strong and faithful throughout the years to come. Next shout out goes to to Judd and Jeremy. Now I hear you guys love the Richie Rich Show, but you don't love doing your homework. Come on guys, study hard in school, and then when you get older, you don't have to bite people for a living. Do yourselves a favor and do your homework. <laughs> Alright. Next shout out goes to Reese. Oh my dear Reese. When are you going to get your parents' permission to be on the show? <sighs> Next shout out goes to Mirinda from Newton. I just wanted to say. Thank you very much for your delightful birthday message. It was outstanding. Speaking of birthday messages, June 27th oh, yeah. is uh, Pastor Caleb's birthday. Uh, Here's a shout out for you, buddy. Happy birthday. May the Lord preserve you and keep you and anoint you further. Final shout out goes to goes to Nadia from Ukraine. <laughs> she knows what it means. Well, that's all we've got time for today, folks. So, let's get on with the show. <laughs> Did you think somebody would have taken my fresh juicy fruit by now? What do you think this is, a comedy? I don't care. I don't even care that I said fresh. Because soon I'm going to be enjoying some nice, juicy fruits. Yeah! As for you, you enjoy the show. You're going to be blessed. For I am persuaded that neither death, nor life, nor angels, no principalities, no powers, no things present, no things to come. No height, no depth, 
nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. My name is Michelle and you're watching The Richie Rich Show. There are many bishops in Lighthouse Chapel International. In June 2014, a very special bishop was ordained. One very dear to my heart, Bishop Oko Bote Doku. Bishop Oko has been a pastor of the Saved Church, the young people of LCI, for over a decade. He preaches in the main church in Accra, Ghana, and has traveled the whole world preaching to young people. I first met him in 2007, and what stuck out to me was not only his huge muscular physique, but his passion for God and his knowledge of God's word. Bishop Oko's style, his panache, and the easy nature makes him the almost perfect vessel for today's young Christian. Second only to Bishop Dagg's sermons, Bishop Oko's messages are the most purchased sermons in LCI. His ministry has touched and changed the lives of so many young people all over the world. For so many years, he was like the bishop of the young people of LCI. And now today, he really is the bishop of the young people of LCI. For your inspiring works, sermons, and your love in Christ for all of us, I thank you. We all thank you. Congratulations, Bishop Oko Bote Doku. It said we don't easily throw our people away. Why do you think people come to camp when they go back? Things are different. It is, it is because a certain man came to walk through the camp. I commissioned Joel into the army of God. That's why I hear the Spirit of the Lord telling you to sing. And you start big and mighty to fight on the side of God. Expect the move of God, and it's not going to be the older generation, it's going to be the new generation that's going to spearhead it. I'm so glad that I'm a part of it. I mean, not part of it in the sense that I'll be a part of it, but part of it in the sense that I'm one of the people who was there to provoke people to love and good works. And I want to say, I love the young people. I was, I, I, I was singing, I said all the time that. You guys will do better than we did. to share my quiet time with you. I read in the Bible this morning from Matthew chapter 5. Agree with thine adversary quickly whilst thou art in the way with him, lest at any time the adversary deliver thee to the judge. Now, Margaret, I don't know yet how this is going to apply to me, but I do start my new job tonight at the most famous fast food restaurant in the entire world, 
McDonald's. And maybe as I go and I think about it and work a little, it will become clearer to me. Well, Margaret, have a beautiful evening, my angel. Six hours later. Here you go, sir. Thank you very much. See you soon. Hello, Anthony. This is your boss, Mr. Best. How was your very first day working for McDonald's? Oh, I'm very much enjoying it, sir. Ho oh, ho, that is good to hear, my boy. Say, Mr. Best, did anybody ever tell you that you sound a lot like that guy? Who randomly calls people to give them money? No, <laughs> I get that a lot. Now concentrate on your work. We don't want to get sued for one million dollars. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Best. Next customer, please. Excuse me, I would like to have a hamburger. I'm sorry, what was that? <laughs> oh right, oh right, no need to shout. <laughs> okay, anything else with that? Yeah! Apple pie! <laughs> One minute later. Okay. Thank you very much. That'll be two forty-nine, please. Excuse me, I ordered Tropicana, not Coke. <laughs> oh no, you didn't! I would have reached for the bottled section if you did. We know what we ordered. Give us Tropicana. I'll give you Tropicana. Remember your quiet time. Agree with your adversary. Agree with your adversary. You know what? I agree. Sorry about that. Here you go. What's all this noise in my McDonald's restaurant? <sighs> Sorry about that, Mr. Bess. I just had a little issue with some customers. Oh, so what did you do? Well, I agreed with them, and I gave them the drink that they wanted, so that we'd all have peace. Wow. That's very mature of you, Anthony. Well done! But since you did that without permission, I'm gonna have to take that out of your wages. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't take one million dollars. Next customer, please. I have an interest in producing Christian shirts. So can you imagine how I felt when I saw this shirt? I'm here to speak about Jesus. I'm not moving to you. What? <laughs> this is perfect for those of you guys who go on outreach during the summer. Girl, I ain't trying to hit on you. <laughs> This shirt was designed by a great dude called Devin. If you want to buy one of these shirts, or a similar one, get in touch with me somehow, and we'll make it happen. Just don't move to me or anything. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed the show, but now I've really got to go. The Bible says, To be thou diligent to know the state of thy flocks. Give careful attention to your herds. I especially enjoy the New Living Translation that says, Know the state of your flocks, and put your heart into caring for your herds. 
Now I see my hurts as my resources and situations in life. My encouragement to you is this. Pay attention to your hurts in this life. Whether it be school, make sure that you're on top of things and doing the best you can. Whether it be work, make sure you're doing well, not on the verge of being fired, but on being promoted. Whether it be ministry, make sure you're doing what God wants you to do. And most importantly, your relationship with God. Make sure that you are indeed relating with God through Jesus Christ. Well, folks, thank you for watching. And please live for Jesus. He is the one worth living for. Take care of yourselves. And now, I am going to enjoy my nice, juicy fruit! Enjoy your fruit, Rich. <laughs> Can you leave, please? Grab. <laughs> <laughs>